Hi, my name is Sunita, and this is my story. I grew up in a nominal Hindu household where we went sporadically to temple, but we did have deities in the house that I would pray to daily. One, one quote that comes to mind here is uh, in St. Augustine's Confessions, he says that because man was made for God himself, our hearts won't rest until they rest in him. So with this, with this idea in mind, I dived into religious studies of all different religions, trying to find my personal connection with God. As I was going through the different religions and learning about the different theologies, I always felt that same disconnect, like something was missing. Um, I felt a little like Goldilocks. So during this time, one memory that would, that would constantly come to mind would be the, the image of one of my best friend's mothers who was passing away from cancer. And while she was bedridden, she would stare at a picture of Christ. Through all of my pursuits of religion, no matter how much of myself I put into each religion, I could never find the peace that I believe she had when she was looking at Christ. One of the most pivotal points in my conversion to Christianity was attending New Life. Now my conversion was very, very slow and gradual and it was met with a lot of reluctance. As I started, as I started attending church more, I started growing I started growing more comfortable with the fact that Christianity could be the answer to my, to my questions. My actual turning point where I was, where most of my questions were answered was when I met Joe Terry, the director of Alpha. To have someone tell his conversion story that was logical and rational, really more so than emotional, really resonated deeply with me. Once, once I became a Christian, my entire outlook changed. I got to know myself on a, on a deeper and more spiritual level. So today I am getting baptized to show my friends and my family and my community the union with God that I have already personally made. And this is how Christ is restoring beauty in me.